Motion Planning for Variable Topology Truss Modular Robot. This work is done by Chao Lu, Senchung Yu and Mark Yim. Variable Topology Truss, or VTT, is a modular robot in truss structure. Each module is a prismatic joint made by spiral zipper actuator, and modules are connected by nodes. The node enables linkages to remain connected during the motion and the geometry shape of a truss can be changed by moving nodes around. Furthermore, two nodes can be linked in an open chain to do topological reconfiguration. Two separate nodes can merge into an individual one. Reversely, a single node can also be split into two. Spiral zipper actuator is lightly actuated with high extension ratio. This enables the large workspace and reconfigurability of the robot. For a VTT, the configuration space of a node is complicated due to the complexity of the obstacle region. The obstacle region is formed by multiple polygons, and a fast algorithm to compute the boundary of the enclosed free space has been presented in our previous work. We extend this work to compute the free space for a group of nodes so that our RT framework can be applied efficiently. The sampling space is decreased a lot and collision check is also much simplified. An efficient collision model can be applied. We just need to check the intersection between any still member with the triangle generated from the moving member. With this framework, we can do the geometry reconfiguration planning very fast. Here we show a scenario that is to reconfigure a truss in cubic shape into a tower. The average planning time consumed for 1000 trials is around 0.8 seconds with the standard deviation of around 0.6 seconds and the success rate is 100%, which is much more efficient than previous approaches. Here is another test scenario that is to reconfigure a truss with an arm into a tower. Six nodes are involved, and the average planning time for 1000 trials is around 0.5 seconds with the standard deviation of around 0.7 seconds, and the success rate is 100%. The next part is the topology reconfiguration. The free space of a node is usually partitioned into multiple enclosed subspaces. If the node want to go from one subspace to another one, then topology reconfiguration is required. We present a fast algorithm to search all enclosed subspaces in the free space of a node. For example, if the node V0 wants to go from its initial position to a position inside this pyramid subspace, we need to split the node in order to overcome the internal obstacle. A transition model is built to connect two adjacent enclosed subspaces and a graph search algorithm can be applied to compute a sequence of topology reconfiguration actions efficiently. Here we show a test result by using our topology reconfiguration planning. We first verify topology reconfiguration is needed if we want to move node V5 from the position in the yellow space to a new position inside the green space because these two spaces are separated, and then find the right way to split the node so that the enclosed free subspaces for both newly generated nodes can contain the goal position. After splitting this node, we can use the previous geometry reconfiguration planner to plan the motion of these two newly generated nodes efficiently. The total average planning time for 1000 trials is around 0.4 seconds with the standard deviation of around 0.02 seconds and the success rate is 100%, including enclosed subspaces computation, topology reconfiguration planning and two-node geometry reconfiguration planning, which is much faster than our previous approach. The next one is a more difficult motion task which involves more topology reconfiguration actions. The task is to move the node from its initial position that is in the center of the truss to a position outside the truss. The node is currently inside the yellow space, while the goal is inside the blue space. Topology reconfiguration is needed. In order to finish this task, we have to first split the node into two, navigate both of them to the green space, and merge them there. Then split the node in another way so that they can be moved and merged in the goal position. 
With 1,000 trials, the average planning time is about 2.3 seconds with standard deviation being 0.5 seconds, and the success rate is 95.8%. This work is funded by AFOSR.